is Airbnb legal in St. George? That's the question that people ask me all the time. Let's talk vacation rentals. According to St. George zoning law, short-term residential rental properties are prohibited in all residential zones, mobile home zones, agricultural zones, residential plant development zones, so pretty much everywhere, except for a couple exceptions. Uh, starting with planned development zones. Now these are zones that have over a hundred units or communities that have over a hundred units. They must have a golf course or a tennis or pickleball court or a pool and clubhouse. Um, so what we're talking about here, we're talking about large resort communities with a resort overlay like uh, Sports Village or Las Palmas. Those are two that are right adjacent to each other over in the Green Valley area. Now another exception to this Airbnb prohibition is in residential areas, but don't get too excited. The criteria is pretty strict. In residential areas, you can do an Airbnb short-term rental if your lot size is greater than two acres, which is huge by the way, you have written consent from all of your neighbors within 300 feet of the property, you must have a business license, and there are pretty stringent parking requirements uh, for those who are staying there. So do you think that uh, everybody on the Airbnb site has gone through all of this whole process? I highly doubt it. Thank you so much for taking the time. Be sure and leave a comment, like the page. You guys are awesome, thanks.